comedian from uh, Nick at Night. Uh, I don't know who that is. Rosemary. Very cultured. Um, no, I'm Rosemary. I am playing Talia, an elf monk. Oh no. Okay. Okay. Sorry about that, folks. Uh, we were uh, having a Rosemary. Uh, continue, please. Um, I'm Rosemary. I'm playing Talia, um, elf monk. Um, and I've been on Murder Hobo, Hobo a couple times. Happy to be back. Very good. Happy to have you back. Uh, below her, I believe we have uh, Mike. Uh, I'm Mike. I'm playing Antonio the Cleric, who has a bit of a thing for burning shit. Uh, that's about it. I look to them yeah. forward to making Blake's Night Hell. We have a fire from character as if I'm not used to those. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, across from him, I think we have Josh. Yeah, I'm Josh. I'm playing Dent the Warforged Artificer. Who is gonna? Who was gonna make Blake's Night Hell before he made me change the character right before we went live? So I'll just make it slightly less hell. Be great. Uh, My bag and, holding says hi. And you're used to you you you've been with us from the beginning, haven't you? Woo! Yep. Fun times. And then our last member here, uh, Dan. <coughs> I'm Dan. I'm playing a uh, wood elf ranger. And this is my first time on Murder Hobos. Oh. I'm great. so sorry. I'm so sorry. You picked <laughs> a lovely like, night. A lot <laughs> I it's fine. That's I've had at least six of my characters killed before, so I'm used to it. Okay. Okay. So I have I have a benchmark there to live up to. Seven. Yeah, exactly. All righty. Uh, and... I am Blake. Uh, normally you see me on the campaign as that one asshole. On other nights I play that other asshole. Sometimes I'm even that third asshole. Uh, but tonight I'm sitting in the big chair so that Frank can have a night off because we can only do so many extra shows and keep you entertained and keep him sane. So uh, I'm informed that we had the uh, synopsis up beforehand. I. Uh, Essentially what is happening is that our merry band of adventurers here is, uh, oh, hang on. I'm being informed by the invisible voice in my ear that I forgot to plug stuff. Uh, follow us on Twitch, follow us on Twitter, follow us on Discord. We're on Discord now. Uh, follow us at the merch shop. Who's got merch? Uh, Murder Hobo has merch somewhere. Okay. Yeah. No one, no one, we don't have any models for you this evening, but we have plenty of fine quality merchandise like a duvet uh, that has all of our murder hobo uh, insignias emblazoned across it. Uh, that's, I believe, right below me would be the link for that. Follow those, check those out. Okay, now getting back to brass tacks. Uh, our merry band of adventurers here has just left the wedding of uh, some old. Uh, childhood friends uh, after what's basically boiled down to a very long weekend worth of partying. Uh, while they were there, they uh, heard that their old mentor had fallen ill and they decided to uh, stop and see him uh, as he was just a short detour on their way back to their hometown. Uh, we're picking up that they are entering the second night out of a three-day trip. Uh, and uh, I'm going to start it by having anyone proficient in survival give me a check. Um, nope. Yeah. Uh, nine? Ooh, 23. Uh, you... 11. <laughs> okay. Um, the 11 will be good enough. Uh, you'll get that you should be somewhere between four and six hours out from your destination. Uh, and this is by cart. Uh, 
for you were you were uh, tasked with obtaining the libations for the festivities. So you basically have uh, a Clydesdale with the Budweiser uh, cart behind you that has all of your possessions and quite a few empty casks in it that you're, but you're basically able to ride along with that. So you're, you're able to make a fairly steady pace and knowing this uh, area, cause you've been back and forth plenty of times. Yeah, you, you, you have a fairly decent idea of where you are. Okay, I got a 23. Can I get like an exact minute count of how far? Oh, we yeah. Uh, <laughs> you're, you're proficient in survival? Yeah. Okay. Uh, then, then yes, you are precisely uh, 372 minutes away, provided you keep this exact pace. Now, if that changes... Exact. That but you're also aware that you'll probably have to go around... Uh, it, it there might be a couple yeah that's what that's what you got um so you continue moving along this area isn't very uh sparsely uh or isn't very densely covered there's not a lot to this here it's pretty much prairie with some scrub brush um Who was the haunted one? I would like the haunted one to give me a history check. Uh, <clears throat> it be a 16 history check. Oh, okay. Uh, you actually are able to recall uh, rumors of uh, some very, very strange goings on at uh, of people disappearing and appearing and, and just, just there seems to be a lot of unusual occurrences coming from the area about two miles ahead of you. Mm -hmm. uh, there also really isn't anywhere else to go. You've been by here plenty of times, but this, you, you're just, this area has always given you kind of the chills and it doesn't seem to be uh, wise to be traveling it at dark. Uh -oh. So what's everyone doing? I'm lost in the fucking woods. I'm just following these guys. I don't know shit about survival. So I have I've got vehicle them. proficiency, so I'm driving. Can you give me an animal handling check? Oh man. Are you proficient? I am proficient in animal handling. Okay. Uh, sixteen. Okay, yeah, that's that's fine. You're yeah, you're. They're not necessarily going at a fever pitch, but you're able to keep them under control and on track. So yeah, you're fine. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna let everyone know about <clears throat> how we're going into what seems to be the rumored Bermuda Triangle of this part of the country. Okay. But otherwise, continue along. I'm sitting shotgun, scouting. Okay. Uh, what race were you? Do you have night vision? Uh, wood elf. And okay. Okay. Then yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead. Give me a perception check. Uh, it won't be at disadvantage. Thirteen. You're not entirely sure, but you do think that you see the outline of a building. But it could be your eyes playing tricks on you. You're not positive. And uh, again, with your high survival check, I'll say that you you know exactly where you think there might be something. Uh, and uh, it's that two miles wasn't quite accurate, so it, it's actually closer. It's actually only about a half mile away. Okay. So the cart is moving and moving and moving, and you're rolling along, and uh, you very, uh, very suddenly and very abruptly are jarred forward. Everyone give me a, uh, a dexterity save, please. 14. Okay. Uh, 21. Okay. 14. Okay. 12. 
12? Yep. Okay, uh, 12 won't make it. So you're going to take three bludgeoning as the uh, sudden halt in movement uh, uh, has you it put, uh, flung forward off of the cart, ass over tits. Uh, you are prone on the ground, but while you're down there, give me a perception check. Another 23. Okay, you needed five or better. Uh, <laughs> you notice that your horse uh, is nowhere to be seen. Where it was, there's a little statue. Oh, God. And, and on the underneath of the statue, it says, no returns. Returns? Exactly like that? Yes. Okay. Turns out that when you rented these horses from the stable master, he was expecting you to be back uh, yesterday. So he has a... Uh, Turn them back into the figurine of wondrous power. Hey guys, we don't have a horse anymore. Dick. Well, Wait. Um. So, question: How? How? You're not going to be able to get the cart moving, Tamlin. Damn it! I have my mechanical guardian. Well, no, actually, no. I, I don't want to say that. That's not fair. Let me hear what you're going to try and do. So. I have okay, a steel you know, defender now, construct. Now, now I can tell you it won't work. Okay, there you go. No, no, no but no, seriously. Okay. What were you going to do? I, I just say maybe I could have my steel defender work with the cart tomorrow when I can rebuild it to something bigger than a dog. But probably not. Oh, okay. That as a draft animal, how how much? Uh, what size is it currently? Uh, it's a. Um, it has to be medium, so it's still be a, a medium creature, just a slightly larger medium creature. So probably not, but that was it. That's actually, yeah. If that weren't such, a, if the size weren't an issue, I would have given. Yeah, that I'll be back one second. Yeah, yeah. I need to get my dice. Um. So you are pretty much effectively stopped here. Uh, there's nothing wrong with your cart in and of itself. Uh, you could proceed to haul it along the road. It's going to severely impact your travel time. Uh, you could camp here and wait it out and see if perhaps someone doesn't come by with a, an animal that they would be willing to part with to help you. You could uh, uh, sit down and cry. Your choices are, are, are pretty limited here. What do you guys want to do? Mm. <clears throat> Am I aware of anything up ahead? Uh, I don't think that anyone brought the the building to your attention yet. Mm. Yeah, there's a building ahead. Should we just try and uh, hoof it into the building? Maybe it's an old rail yard station by chance. Uh, with actually, with that suggestion. Uh, Anyone proficient can give me a nature check, and anyone not proficient can give me a perception check. Twenty-one perception. Okay. Fourteen perception. Okay. Thirteen perception. Okay. Uh, you all three of you will notice. Oh. Yeah, we probably better get inside because it's it's actually just start raining. Can I quietly approach the building? Uh, it's you're far enough away that that's if you're a good distance away, but there isn't really anywhere else to be considered cover uh, within your line of vision. Like the camera froze again. Okay, wait. Oh. There you go, there you go. So I have Mask of the Wild, which means I can attempt to hide even when I'm only slightly obscured. Okay. Uh, there's moderate scrub brush, so I would say that you can moderately be obscured, but as a party, you cannot uh, obscure the entire group. Oh, God, what did I miss? 
what is it? we died we're, we're all dead oh, it, it's shit. raining nice and yep it's it's starting to rain shit do we have to continue on with the cart or is one of our options to leave it behind while we continue oh yes you can absolutely leave it Fuck the cart. Okay. is there anything are we actually storing anything in the cart or is it just like does it just have like a lot Good of alcohol question. in it <laughs> Yes. Can we can we put a cart in a bag of holding? Yes. <laughs> I have a bag of holding. Uh, give you a d12 against me. It'll tell you how long it takes to break it down. Six. Uh, nine. It'll take you about uh, thirty minutes to uh, break it down. Because I can see how many. Where's, where'd where'd that bag of holding come from? Uh, it's one of my infusions. I can recreate a magical item. I, uh, it's an artificer thing. Yeah, it's so bullshit. Gotcha. Okay. Which means he pulled it out of his ass. Yeah. No, I made it out of a normal bag. <laughs> yeah. I took a I took a lovely satchel bag and I went. I want this to be a bag of holding, so I made it a bag of holding. What, what's the uh, What's the volume on that? That's what I was going to check along. Um, it can store <clears throat> five hundred pounds and uh, not exceeding a volume of 68, 64 cubic feet. You've got more than 500 pounds here. Okay, uh, how much stuff are we storing in the cart? The, 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 yeah. the wagon itself is going to be 500 pounds. So how much stuff is in the cart that we should probably take? By this time you you have, you get, it's basically loaded down with pony kegs that you're gonna take back for your return, for your deposits. How much are those, how much those pony kegs weigh? Well, that they're going to be very cumbersome to break down into a messenger satchel. Um, we should probably and, grab and, the horse. And, and, and you have a feeling that the cooper is not going to uh, easily relinquish your deposit. Yeah. Um, we should probably grab the, the figurine of the horse, just because we could sell it to an idiot at this point. Um, <laughs> yeah, that's fair. They don't know how it works. We just say, hey, look, this, this amulet turns this figure and turns into a horse. You just got to figure out the code word. Uh, go ahead Wait. and uh, everyone give me another perception check. Jesus you, you Jesus standing Christ. around fucking with that. 18. Uh, 14. 19. Okay. Um, question. Sure. Because I'm un unclear, unclear on this. The spell identified. Does it tell you code words? I don't think it does. Does it? it this has it on the on the. This ha it does, but uh, yes, you learn all of the information needed to work an item. So yes, okay. it, it, but it's you get the impression that this was more of a, a time per time okay. type of okay. issue rather gotcha. than rather than it not working. Okay. But if you'd like to, if you'd like to, if you'd like to burn a ritual, uh, identity. Nah, I'm good. I'm good. We can we can not sit here for what ten minutes dealing with that shit. Nah, I'm good. Uh, did did you make your perception, Tamla? Eighteen. Eighteen. Okay. Uh, actually, you are all then aware of the fact that this seems like an awful lot more water than it should be. Uh, and. It is coming down hard and fast, and it is coming down at such a rate that you need initiative. Oh, God. Jesus Christ. Seven. No, eight. Eight. Ooh. I'm 14. Okay. Oh, my God. Uh, I got a one, so five. Not last place. I got a seven. And oh boy. Not even second to last. All right. My it's not the worst, <laughs> not even the worst half of the group. Yes. Mother Mother Nature got. I'm using my curse D20, so I'm gonna roll like shit all game. It's gonna be cool. I'm not I'm not using this one anymore. Incredibly it makes it interesting. Incredible. Yeah. You just you just keep a holding on to that one and perfectly fine with that. Uh so uh, remember your rolls, guys. I'm not going to have you roll at the start of every round just for the sake of time. We're just going to keep that and plug along. So, uh, Mother Nature got only got a 13, so the 14 is up. Uh, punch that rain. Yeah, the fuck is going on here? Yeah, are we like punching uh, the rain? There, there's, there's a 
torrent of water just headed towards you that seems to almost have a sentience to it. Oh, instead. it's a... Uh, a mental? A trap? Elemental. Uh, I'm, you know what, I'm just going to cast Sacred Flame at it. Okay, that'll work. That's a deck save, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, it's either a... It's a 10. It fails. So... Okay. It takes 11 points of damage. Okay, there's a sizzle as some of the substance of whatever was coming at you seems to dissipate. Uh, it's not particularly thrilled about that. So yes, the water elemental is going to slam at you, or I'm sorry, it's going to attempt to whelm you. Whelm? Yes, whelm. How do you, how do you spell that so I can look it up? It, so it's not overwhelm or underwhelm, it's just whelm. Yes, well, overtake you. It's basically going to try and overwhelm. It's it's going to enter your space and try and restrain you in the water. What save? You need to give me a uh, strength fifteen. I got a sixteen. <laughs> okay. Uh, so then you are not restrained, but you are going to take some bludgeoning damage as the force comes towards you. Uh, so that's going to be 10 plus, that's going to be 14 bludgeoning. Yes. And uh, one, two, three, four. Well, that's going on. Uh, Dan, you don't notice the one that was coming from the other direction and attempts to do the same to you. Um, that's an attack roll, right? It's a strength save. Oh, okay. Same okay. as attack roll. Am I at a disadvantage because I didn't see it? No, I'm not going to give you disadvantage because it's it's there's just water everywhere. It's It's not really... Okay. You're, it's, you're just more aware of a sense of being moved. Ooh, 20. Okay, so yeah, you're not going to be grappled either, but you are also going to take damage. Uh, 12. Uh, you're going to take 16. Oh my god. And then number 8 is up. Uh, who had the 8? I had the 8. Okay. Two water elementals. Um, that you can see. That I can, excuse me, see. Um, I'm going to attack the first one with my short sword. And I'm okay. gonna, I have uh, two attacks, so I'm gonna try to hit it twice. What's okay. it, Stacey? Uh, 14, it is also in the same, uh, it, it, it's still surrounding your companion, so go ahead. Yeah, fuck it. And this is how my first what character was? died. Sorry? What did you roll? Uh, I have a, uh, not a dirty 20 and a 13. Uh, 14 was the AC. Okay, so hit with a dirty 20. So uh, these... For the dirty 20, roll a, give me another 20. Don't roll a one. Nine. Okay, you, you, you're, you're able to avoid slashing, uh, slashing your friend. So I do uh, nine damage to that. Okay. And then I have my construct attack. Okay. Oh, shit. With my bonus action, and I almost dropped my metal die on my wood floor. That would have been bad. <laughs> Two attacks and a bonus action. So, uh, I get the extra attack from um, being level five. So it's just you attack twice on your attack. Oh, okay, that's an automatic. And then, as my bonus action, I'm giving the okay. robot a command to attack. Gotcha. Okay. Instead of me attacking a second time, because gotcha. I could, I have two weapon fighting too. But... 
Um, he has plus four. Yes, so he hits with a 16. You may roll a d20 again. Uh, is he considered magical? <laughs> he... I don't... I mean, he's like a robot. He's literally like a, a mechanical construct. So, so, so it's 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 more clockwork than yes, than... yes. Okay, okay. So I'm going to say that he's not magical. So he's going to he, he doesn't seem to do nearly as much as you think he should. Okay, so um, he hits for seven. Okay, before any modifications. Okay, that works. Okay, that do it for you. Yeah, that's my turn. Okay. Uh, the seven is up. That's me. Okay. I get to attack twice. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, I think I'll attack with my weapon, um, but I'll use it as a quarterstaff. So it's going to be bludgeoning if it hits. Okay. And and you heard us uh, say that that's going to be plus two, plus two. So, so that is going to be considered magical. It, okay. Oh yeah, he was giving out magic items. I think it was right before. Yeah, I missed that one because I got on yeah. like five minutes before it started. So okay. Yeah. So the first one is, oh god, math, uh, twenty four to hit. Yep, twenty four hits. Okay. And then. Second one is 22 to hit. Yep, that, that'll hit too. Okay, and I'm using it two-handed, so okay. I'm just going to roll the damage at once. And, and, and which one are you going after? The one, uh, the one encompassing which of your friends? Um, is there one that's more injured than the other, or can I tell? So, so far, everyone has been attacking the first one, which was going after uh, the cleric. I am your the brother, cleric. Rosemary. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna protect the, I'm gonna attack the one that's going after Talion. Okay. Um, it. and it's gonna give, uh, it's gonna take thirteen damage. Total for both. Yeah, for both. Okay, that works. Uh, okay. And is that it? And that is all I can do, I think. Okay. Uh, that brings us to, uh, the ranger with that big, big old one. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um, I am, can I attack from inside? You, you're other? not being restrained or grappled in any way, but you are effectively being so it's it's whooshing around you so you're not suffering any penalties because you made your save okay so i can like spin around in a circle and just shoot anywhere and i'm gonna hit this elemental that's like it's essentially yes your attacks are going to be i, I i'm going to say that your ac your ac to hit is only going to be an eight okay uh then i'm going to use my magical longbow to attack twice okay out of out of the shooting out of the water Yes, away from my party. Uh, give me a give me a an in or give give me a wisdom save. No, I'm sorry, intelligence. That would be intelligence. Ten. Uh, just barely, but yeah, you're able to determine that. Okay, this is. The, the, the refraction of your vision from the water throws it off enough that no, you're actually you need to aim over here and not over there. Okay, cool. Ugh, six for the first one. Twelve for the second. Okay. So because I did say that you were actually only having to hit an eight, that twelve will hit. Sweet. Uh, that is one D eight plus six piercing. Okay. Fallen. Uh, 14 damage. Not bad. And then my Bloodhawk will attack next. Okay. 
And again, is the are these considered magical just for my reference? Um, it's just a beast companion, so I don't believe so. I don't think any of the companions are magical, unless they're okay. like like. I, I thought there was a level that they got to and they did, but <clears throat> I didn't, that's fine. That's way out. <laughs> Not a level six. Okay, so what's what? Did, excuse me. What does he do? He is just going to. So he he has been circling. He saw this shit coming. Uh, he's been circling up above. And so he he's gonna. Warn, and he didn't warn you. How helpful is he? Yeah, he's kind of a dick, but you know, I love him anyway. Uh, he's gonna dive bomb and attack with his beak. Okay. 17. Yeah, that'll hit. Okay. I believe that it is just a straight four piercing damage. Okay, so that's going to be, again, not, not as effective as you think it should be. Right, because it's half water. Yeah, it could be halved. So, uh, that brings us <clears throat> to the top of the round uh, with the 14. <laughs> uh, give me a deck save. Uh, okay. From the one that is around you? Yes. Uh, that's a 21. Ooh. Give me a second. What do you do? Just Sacred Flame. Uh, I that, think... That, yeah, that does nothing. Yeah, if he, if he saves, it just does nothing. The on here it says damage on a fail, or half damage on a failed save. It should say no damage for Sacred Flame. Oh, wait, never mind. Never mind. I had Fireball up in my bed. <laughs> <laughs> That's a little bit of a difference. <laughs> let, me, let me dream. I don't feel like bringing up Fireball this early. You don't want to, you don't want to, you know, Broken Arrow, Danger Close? No. Nah. Right, right, right all up around you. Get just just fill, fill nuke all. the car, nuke the party, nuke the water elementals, just nuke everything. Fuck it. We'll be done in, what, half an hour? Yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll do Blake's job for him. Yeah, yeah. Just, in, just in the game right there. <clears throat> okay, so you we we're going with Sacred Flame, and that's it. Yeah. Okay. Uh, you're not gonna move at all. Uh, can I even move? You can, but it'll get an attack on you. Yeah, I was gonna say I didn't think it was worth it. Okay. Uh, so uh, at this point, everyone, go ahead and give me an. Uh, if you're if you're proficient in insight, you can give me a check. Hey, I should have that. Thirteen. Is that it? Oh, is someone else proficient? Yeah, thirteen, I guess. Okay. Uh, never mind. Keep going. <clears throat> um, oh, my it's, turn. It's, it's you. My turn. Yeah, it's yeah, you. Um. Well, they burned the they burned their one. Oh, hang on, I get to see if that recharges. One, it does for one, not for the other. So odd, even, even. Okay. So uh, you, uh, I need from Antonio. I need another strength save as you feel the force of this water begin to in a very similar manner. It's going to be a 19. Okay, so now you're, you're going to take your damage. That's 6, 10, 10 bludgeoning. Uh, the other one isn't able to do that. Uh, so it's just basically going to uh, lash out and, and you feel it uh, uh, smack you. One, Yeah, there's going to be one for one for I'm gonna to have to roll for that one actually. Is it is it doing an attack roll? It's do, it's doing it's doing it's doing a two attacks against the three of you. So um my you, you, were, you were going after the other one. I'm sorry. Yeah. So but yeah. my um oh wait, it's not within five feet. Never mind. Ignore me. Yeah. Okay. It's on the other one. Well, uh, Talia, you uh does a 26 hit you. Yeah, it does. <laughs> okay, just just checking. Uh, that's going to be uh, 
14 bludgeoning. Mm, Bill. Okay, that's all they can do though. Uh, you, uh, might want to make another insight check. I'll let anyone who isn't pro who isn't proficient make it. Is not? Yeah. I'm going to roll my, my attacks while they do that. Uh, 13. The water seems to be basically healing these things as it's raining. Uh, they don't really quite seem to, any, any of the substance that's been torn away by your attacks seems to be repairing itself over time. Can it is we, time to break out fireball. Can we cut and run, or is that not an option? They will most likely get an attack on you, but that's always an option. Uh, I hit, by the way. With all, I, I'm using two up in fighting, so I'm attacking three times this time. I don't know if you only have rolled 20s again to see if I hit them or not. How many, just how many of your attacks hit? Three. Three, all three of them did? Yes. Okay. How much? Um, it was a dirty 20, a 15, and no, damn a... It. Oh, damage. sorry. Gotcha. Um, that's 16. Jesus, I rolled two ones in a row. So 22? Okay. And that was the same one? <clears throat> yeah, that's the one that's on Antonio. Okay, cool. Okay. Uh, yeah, even with that, it, it, it does look injured still. It's not fully healed, but it, it, does, it doesn't seem to be as damaged as you would have thought it should be, just in general. Uh, everyone make a perception check. That one. 21. 23. Okay. Uh, 12. Okay. The nat one uh, turns out that there must be some ocean nearby because this is so, these are saltwater elementals and that burns like a son of a bitch. Um, um. The, rest, the rest of you are actually able to, uh, in, in the direction of this building that was pointed out to you, you do actually see a light in, a, in an upstairs window. Uh, you can very, very clearly, it, it does look like there is uh, possibly someone there who might be able to give you some aid and allow you to rest. But that's a good 600 yard dash away still. 600 yards? Oh. That brings us to <clears throat> Rosemary. Jesus. Okay. Um, do I get to attack and then move? Is that uh, you have you have your attack your attack portion and your and your movement portion of your action. Okay, I'm gonna attack okay. the same one again twice. Okay. The same way. Okay. Um. And you were doing this as the quarter staff. So were you doing that at reach? No. Okay. No, I wasn't. Okay. Um. So that's gonna be. I'll be back quick. Seventeen to hit, and a nineteen to hit. And those will both connect. Okay. And then where's my D eight? Ten. Where's my? Eight? Oh, there it is. Okay. So 14 damage. Okie doke. And then if I okay, if I book it, it's going to take a, a, an attack against me, right? Potentially, but once it's taken it, it won't be able to do that again until it's turned. Okay. So is if, there any way to is there any way to like not take damage from that attack? If you would have taken the disengage action instead of attacking. What if I do a bonus action of disengage? You are you're not a 
uh, you don't have a cunning act, or you have you have step I of have, the wind. I have, you have high point. Yes, you have step of the wind. So yes. Yeah, I have step burn, of the wind. Burn some key and do that. Absolutely. Key. Okay, so. Oh, are we cutting and run? Fuck. <laughs> Oof. See you, bitches, later. I am booking it towards the building. Okay. Uh, fair enough. Uh, what's your movement, just for the record? Sixty feet. Sixty feet is because you're you, you're not dashing. Because you're just, just yeah, just that's just my normal is okay. sixty feet. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, so you're gonna make it no problem. <laughs> Bye, guys. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So uh, these, these two are are. Oh wait, I gotta make sure where I am. So these two. <laughs> are fucked. <laughs> All right. Uh, you, uh, you you had the natural one on your perception, didn't you? Yes. So I don't even know <laughs> she's gone. Well, oh well, no, it's it's not your turn. It's uh, I uh, guess. You don't even you don't even know where you are. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but but no, uh, you you are able to discern that uh, you're compatriot seems to be getting smaller. Hi. <laughs> I'm happy I got the boots of the winding path. Jesus. <laughs> Just teleport the fuck out of this bitch. Uh, but but it is it is it is the Ranger's turn. Okay, so question. Okay. I have the spell pass without a trace. Okay. If I'm if I'm inside the mm -hmm. elemental, it would not be able to track you as as it watched you walk away. Well, I'm doing that then. No, it's the keyword as it watches you walk away. That's fine. That's fine. That's a risk I'm willing to take. Okay. So I'm going to pass without a trace. Okay. And all of my companions within 30 feet of me have <laughs> uh, a plus 10 to dexterity slash uh, stealth checks. Okay. Don't know why I didn't do that earlier, but so I'm going to nope the fuck out of here. Okay. Uh, you're going to. <clears throat> Uh, does a 26 hit you? Yeah. Okay, yeah. First, you're going to take Jesus. another 12 bludgeoning, as it does take an opportunity attack because it, it is very aware of your presence because you're not <laughs> able to hide. Okay. As you leave, As you leave its entity, it feels your presence pushing forward through it. Found a new kink. All right, cool. Uh, but but you are able to safely move out of its out of its range, or not? Well, not safely, successfully. <laughs> Thank you for the clarification. Yeah. Okay. I am running. Uh, pass without a trace would have been your action, so your dash will go into effect next turn. So you're just at full movement, not double movement. Well, that, yeah, that's what I meant. I'm okay. out. Okay. Okay. All right. Uh, the <laughs> I'm in blind, danger. The, the blind artificer. <laughs> or, what? Uh, yeah. No, no so, Tony. Tony. I'm sorry. Yeah. Yeah. Tony, sorry. Yeah. Sorry. I, I <sighs> did a shitty job of writing down the order. And your character names too. I did a shitty job of not writing those down. Actually, I did a fantastic job of not writing those down. To be fair, you did say, "Don't send me your character sheets. I just want to know your backgrounds." Oh yeah, that's why I, keep, I I got those memorized. So, am I aware that everyone has just bolted the fuck out of here? Uh, you were you were successful enough on your perception that you're not you're not blinded. Uh, go ahead and anything above a three on a d twenty. Yeah, you're you're able to see them piece and yeah. out. Yeah, okay. passed. Okay. How what? How big is the water elemental surrounding me? Uh, it's like, give, give or take three times your size. 
so well i guess let me rephrase that it started off three times your size now it's about two and a half how far away is the other elemental uh better part of 15 feet hmm. so if it's three times my size is it I'm, I'm, ta I'm talking i'm talking outer border 15 feet yeah i'm just so fireball's a 20 foot radius Can oh I my god them? Without yeah, I'll, hitting I'll, I'll, let you, I'll let you hit both of them, but you're going to get an attack of opportunity while you remove yourself at a safe enough distance to do that, unless you want to take the fire damage. Well, that, that's, why, that's why I was asking is, can I hit the one surrounding me? Is it far enough away that I can hit the outside of it without hitting he's myself? Trying to, he's trying to hit the corner. You're going to hit water, me. But, but there's enough water surrounding you that it's not going to be able to permeate through. It's basically just going to have an, if you want to hit both, you have to leave. If you want to hit this one, I'll say that you can, you can expel it forward, but it's going to evaporate water instead of actually leaving the, uh, leaving the boundary. Boil that motherfucker alive. Do it. Do uh, it. You won't. Uh, do you it. Do, do run that. I, I'll, I'll also have you, um, I'll tell you, I'm going to have you make a deck save to make sure you don't scald yourself. I do have plus 10. That's, that's that is true. That is oh, true. Yeah. Yeah. So, wait, is that, so if I cast it right, if I cast it in between the two, is it just a deck save? Then? If you're, or is it a matter of the? It originates from you, correct? Uh, it's no. It, it's basically you point and then a little pew hits that point. And and then, goes, but, but where is it originating from? Is my in your finger. Okay, so it's originating from him. No, if you yeah. if you cast it. At that point, it is not going to be able to permeate the water unless you leave this unless you leave this thing's perimeter. Boil it and let's get the fuck out of here. So you're if if you stay in here and cast it, you're going to hit this one. If you leave, you're you can hit both of them. Burn that mother down. Yo, uh, you're you're a light cleric, right? Yes. So wild thought, radiance of the dawn. Is that radiance of the dawn? Frank's favorite. It's Frank's favorite class feature. <laughs> yeah, sure. I'll use Radiance of the Dawn. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> uh, thank, God there are, thank God there aren't any undead later. Thank you, Tamara. Uh, constitution saves. Okay. Uh, the highest is a 12. Okay. And what exact explain this exactly? What are you doing? Uh, dispels any magical darkness, and then each hostile creature that doesn't have total cover within thirty feet may make a con save. And for for what? I was thinking then does damage. Yeah, for twenty twenty four damage a piece each. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. They're, they're both still in as intact as a water elemental can ex be expected to be. <clears throat> Shit. Uh, but you, you do notice that that did, that did break apart their volume to some extent. Hmm. Uh, we might have to two-man <laughs> these two because we're smart party fucking bail. But, but, but so but you didn't move in order to cast that, did you? No. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah, and I don't think I have anything I want to do for bonus action. Yeah. I'm just going to yell goddamn water elementals. Uh, <clears throat> okay, so then that brings it to me. None of them get that, so good news. They're just going to multi-attack you. Uh, one on each of you, effectively, uh, because you're the two in range. Yes. Uh, one of the ones that's on attacking me um, is at disadvantage. Um, yes. Because of the dog. I have deflect attacks. Any uh, enemy within five feet of a dog can deflect the attack. Is that and an, he's like, attack or, an attack or all attacks? An attack. Well, good. That saves the the, the twenty that knocked that deep, that net twenty down to a seventeen. 
So oh. that'll miss. Yep. Uh, and that second one will miss. Uh, and actually, both will miss unless a 16 hits you, Mike. Yep. Okay. Yep. No, that's their turn's over. So uh, I got a one on that perception check. Yep. Am I, am I, I'm blinded, right? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, uh, can I like can I like spend my action just like to wipe the shit out of my eyes so I can see? Uh, it, since it's basically a chemical blindness, you're going to have to find an eye wash station. Ironically enough, can I like dump a canteen on it? Like yeah. just spend my turn going ah. Yeah, that's perfectly acceptable. But, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna use my action to dump my canteen. Going ah, get the chemical burn out of my eyes. Good, good news, you healed it. Yes. Now, I'm going to use my bonus action. Yep. Wait, do I notice the other two have left? Uh, that your bonus action would be to take a look around. Okay. Uh, that's a 19 on a oh, perception. Yeah. Oh, 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 yeah. You can, you, you, see, you see them book in it, uh, except I guess you would be at disadvantage because they're passing without a trace. Actually... I don't think Tally, I am. I think I was Tally on a range. Wouldn't. Yeah, Talia yeah, would. Yeah, oh, yeah, because she left first. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, no, you, yeah, you, you, you see her easy easy enough. You you kind of catch a glimmer of something that might be him. Shit. Um, <laughs> do I leave Antonio to die and run? You know what? I'm not even making the decision. I'm going to leave it up to the die. I'm going to roll this on camera. Someone's going to die, and it's probably me. <laughs> uh, if it's an even, I'm going to run. If it's an odd, I'm going to stay. Let's see. Hey, it's an odd. Okay. I'm going to stay, and I'm okay. going to help my, my cleric friend fight these elementals. Okay. Until he runs, and then I'm going to run away. Okay. Now with these fuckers dead. So I'm not gonna move. That's when my turn. Okay. They're at they're at half damage, just for the record. They're like at half health? Yeah. Okay. This should be fun. Let's do it. Hmm. Yeah. Am I up? This is uh, be great. yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's going to yeah. go that fantastic. Brings us, that brings us to the top of the well. Well, no, bottom guys, of the order. You guys are running. I'm. I'm sorry. If you weren't taking your action to flee during that last round, let me know. Okay. No, I'm still running. Okay. Then yeah, I I, I had kind of taken you out of the order because I figured that's you fine. Were gonna, yeah. And the same for the ranger. So uh, unless unless I, I'm going to keep doing that basically unless you chime in that you kind of want to take a look around and notice that you're not being followed. Yeah, I'm being followed because you left the rest of the party to die. <laughs> okay. Well, it's going to be a short night for us. Hey, Tamlin, what if I cast fireball at them? <laughs> yes, yes, you should do that. What you should definitely do that. But like, you can't see me. Like to get the fireball <laughs> to permeate the thing around you, you have to exit it first. <clears throat> Just saying, but yeah. Just saying, I can teleport fifteen feet if you want to run. So. Oh, there mm. you go. Mm, I can teleport me fifteen yeah. feet. Yeah, I figured. Not, it was not you. Not you. You teleport me fifteen feet, <laughs> dude. Put Antonio in your bag of holding and just fucking run. Yes. <laughs> yes, what wait, what race are you? Yeah, how much do you weigh? Yeah, I don't know if I can get a human in a bag of holding now. I, how I, long you have to, to disassemble him first. Right, how long to deconstruct <laughs> a human into a satchel? Uh actually only five minutes, but <laughs> I have less than restoration. It's a little I'll, messy. I'll, I'll, just, I'll cut I'll work. cut the arms off at the shoulder and I'll just I'll just jam them in. Yeah, but then I'll, I'll cast fireball. I'll, I'll reattach the arms later. <laughs> Nose or something instead well, of your. I, 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 I think yeah. Hey, give, give me an intelligence check, uh, Tamlin. Uh, just straight intelligence. Yeah, yeah. Just check. Um, that would be an eighteen. 
Oh yeah, Intelligence yeah. Is my best yeah. Stat. Once, all, all you need is his arm to be able to cast that fireball. So yeah, once you got him. <laughs> so so what you're saying is I could take his arm and point it at something, and then he could say, "I cast fireball." <laughs> That's what you think. I have, uh, I have a portable. <laughs> I have a portable cleric gun. <laughs> Finger guns. Yeah. <laughs> um. Hmm. Uh, so is it my turn again then? Yes, yes. yes. It, is your, it is your turn again, and uh, mm. I, I, I fire fireballing your your uh, turncoat uh, companions is always an option. But like I said, if you wanted right. to leave the leave the boundary of the elemental that is around you, you have to exit it first. I could probably survive one turn if you wanted to run first. I'm gonna use cure wounds first. <laughs> Okay. Now, oh, you, now you're disadvantaged, Tamlin. That was within five feet, and you're in melee, correct? Uh, yes. Okay. So you could impose disadvantage on the opportunity to attack if I chose to make it. Yes. If you wanted to. On his opportunity, I don't even. You're not going to get an opportunity to attack on me, but I can impose it on his. Yes. That, that's, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. So <sighs> I, I'm, I'm yeah. just wanting to clarify. Clarify that for him. If you want to run, I could impose disadvantage. I think he can too, can't you? Because of the light cleric pew pew fireworks thing. They're think... ele they're elementals. They I know that they have a, a thing. Where is it? I'm oh, gonna, I say, I'm gonna say that these things have blind sense. I know it's a oh they can't be blinded, yeah. Never mind then. An attacker that can't be blinded is immune to this feature. Yeah. So, yeah, I, I mean, I got some health hack. We'll see how this next turn goes. But giving them disadvantage <clears throat> on an attack of opportunity would be good for me to get away and then like. Yes, because my me and my dog are still on the one that's on you. We right. didn't but turn around to attack yeah. the one that's on me. Yeah, I, I, I thought that would so, be good to point out. Yeah. So if you can give him disadvantage so I can get away this next round. Or have a better chance of getting away. I mean, you can so. do, you can still run. You have your movement. Well, yeah, yeah, you yeah. can you can still heal first if you want. That's perfectly yeah. yeah the or, the you, order you of, just won't have a dash. Yeah, I know. Uh, yeah, I'll try and move thirty feet away and yell to Dent to get the fuck out of there. I'm gonna do something. All right. Okay. And so. Yeah, as as you move, it is going to take its uh, at disadvantage. Even, it didn't even need it. A three and a five. All right. Boo. Yeah. All right. Now I get railed on by what six attacks. Let's do it. Uh, I'm going to roll. It's okay. You're not. You're not going to die on me. Yeah. No. I'm going to. I'm going to roll even odd. Uh, even odd for the first one. Even they they stay on you. Odd. They chase. They pursue him because, again, they're aware of the direction he left. That's odd and odd. If I shoot my bow from passing without a trace... Oh, yeah, that, that, that won't break that. The, 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 these things are... Vision is, vision is a very weird sense right now, so mm. you're effectively... Vision is a social construct. Yes, you're, you're effectively not going to reveal your position in, in, in any way, but... You get the impression that that wasn't really an issue in the first place. Okay, well, I got a bomb ass range, so I would like to be reinstated into my okay. initiative at uh, some, whenever it's my turn. Uh, okay, so uh, well, I, before uh, before Tamlin or goes or after Tamlin goes, you because you had the net one, so yes, you can go ahead and take care of that. Uh, I will make you roll. Uh, anything below a five. In order to line this up, unfortunately, this thing did line itself up right behind your friend as he's fleeing. Oh, so they're both chasing him. Yes. Yeah. Oh, so neither one of them hit me. Nice. Okay, yeah, so yeah, it's my turn. Yeah, they they are not going to go after you. They're going to pursue. All right. Um, but that well, doesn't bother me. How far ahead have they moved? Uh, they've only moved twenty feet. That's why they didn't get an attack round. Okay, so they can only move twenty feet. Yeah, and I'm not I'm not having them dash. Uh, Antonio, what's your what's your uh, movement? 
30. So I'm 10 feet ahead of them. 30? Okay, so um, I'm going to use my bonus action to use my... uh, Where the hell are they? The Boots of the Winding Path. It's one of my other infusions. Sure. Um, As a bonus action, I can teleport up to 15 feet. So I'm just going to teleport in the general direction of where Antonio's running. Okay. Um, so 15 feet ahead of you in that direction will put yeah, you. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get myself like 10 feet between me and the water element. It'll I'm put, just gonna go. Uh, it'll, it'll put you right in the middle of it if you go that direction. Mm-hmm. Otherwise, you're going to have to Pythagoras it. Yeah, that's basically what I'm doing. I'm not okay. gonna go exactly like right behind him, but like gotcha. in that vague direction to where I'm not, you know, swimming in water element. Okay, so you're you're wanting to basically be. Perpendicular yeah. next to yes. me. Yeah, perpendicular. Yes. Gotcha. Okay. Um, and then I'm going to move and then dash. And my movement is 30, so I'll move another 60 feet. Yeah, because that was a bonus. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Yes. And then um, I think my dog can just move. Do I have to tell him to move? Hold on. This is a good it's- question. Yeah, I, I, I'll, I'll give him free. I'll, I'll say that unless otherwise ordered, he will attempt to follow you just for just for yeah. simplicity's sake. I only have to command him to dash, so he can move on his own. It's just if I want him to dash, but I have he's to, not use my able to catch up to you. But he's able yes. To well, you. I didn't want him to catch up with me. I want him to stay in step with Antonio. Okay. To keep giving the disadvantage if he gets caught up with. Oh, all right. Gotcha. That should that shouldn't be a problem. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I don't think it ma- it might not matter at this point. So, I'm way far ahead of you at this point. There's yeah. I okay, might as you, well you, do you it. You know what I'm doing. I need yeah, to yeah. dice. Yeah, that's also why I'm moving him because I don't have to rebuild him. Yeah. So but but no 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 no. Uh, we we have a before you go though, you do feel an arrow whiz whiz by you. Uh from up ahead. Let's see if it actually hits anything. <laughs> All right, two arrows, <clears throat> two attacks. Okay, so that's an 18 and a an eight. Okay, uh, you're no longer surrounded by this, so you lost your AC AC uh, modifier from, oh. from when it was surrounding you. So the eight will miss. All right, real uh, quick. As a point of uh, order, I don't have dark vision. Should I make a roll to make sure I'm not going in the wrong direction? Uh, I will say that you, as you saw him take off uh, the light cleric, the moon would be there's enough there's okay. enough moon. Ref- okay. Uh, you okay? Uh, I guess I guess give me light. No, 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 we'll do it this way. Give me a perception light to see if you see the light in the window. Uh, when that came up, you were blind. 14? Yeah, you can see the light in the window. So you can see that that's most likely the direction that they were okay. headed. The moon shines off the shiny water asses of the elementals. Woo! Yeah, but water it's, asses, it's, that's it's, a word it's, I think. Rainy, rainy, that. <laughs> so the moon is obscured. That's why I had to do it that way. So, yeah, no, no, you're, you're going to be fine as far as your direction goes. Uh, so but the, sure that, that eight does miss, but the other one connects. Uh, the eight is not low enough to oh, wait, wait. Secure, to secure your companion, so you're fortunate there. How much damage do you do? Twelve. Twelve. Yep. Okay. Uh, and does your animal companion want to take a dive at it, or is that not something that you can do? Oh, he can. He just is not going to. Okay. Fair enough. Uh, <laughs> Those boots don't have a recharge. <laughs> so one time one and done. No, no, they think they can use them every time. <laughs> no, 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 you can't. No, you can't. <laughs> I, I, I'm, I'm telling you, no. no yeah, no. I figured it'd be like long rest or short rest or something. Let's just I'm call. Gonna, you, I'm going I'm to give it at least a short. Yeah, let's just call it short rest. Yeah, I'm fine with that. Honestly, that's what I expected it to be. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, so uh, <laughs> top of the order. Uh, Next saves. Well, uh, these are the top of the order. Yeah. Yes, yes, top of the order. Yes, go ahead. <clears throat> Deck saves from the water. Yes. Okay. I assume they're within 40 feet of each other. Uh, yes, they would be. Uh, one passes with two. Oh. That's a 14 dex. 
Okay, well, yeah, one pass is it rolled a 16, the other one only ha has an eight. So one pass, one fail. Uh, odd, odd, I'm go the one that you're, I'll let you roll this, odd or even. Odd is the one that you're probably going to be able to dissipate with this. Odd, get a five. Woo! That's, that's the one that failed. All right. But I'm, I'm still waiting to hear damage. I said probably. Uh, 33 damage. Oh, guess what? We're just short. No, 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 that one's gone. Woo! <clears throat> so the other one's just short? Oh, no, the other one's, uh, that is, that's half, I'm, I'm assuming, for the other one? Yeah. yeah. So uh, that'd be the other one's, 16. The other, the other one almost seems uh, as though it's being fed by the steam emanating from its companion. It's, it, it, it well, shit. It, 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 it was about halfway there, then it was about a quarter way there, now it's about a third there. So it's. I think we can still do this. You want? Do you want to fight? Well, if it's a third of the way there. I mean, are you going to use your words and tell me that you want to fight, or are you just going to assume that I would notice? Because I'm yeah, not going to fuck him up. All right, there we go. Using our words. Okay, that's it. It's turn. Uh, and it will. So did you did you move? Did so you didn't move your turn then, did you? Mm. I probably should have, honestly. <laughs> probably. Is this, hey, to be fair, I can impose this advantage on what attack. Yeah, and yeah, so that's yeah, that's why I was. That's not going um, to matter. You're just gonna smother him. I gotcha. Yeah, because it, it, yeah. it regained its, it regained its smother last turn. Okay. Oh, oof. So if you did, if you didn't move, I need a strength fifteen. In all fairness, I didn't say I moved. So uh, twenty non natural strength. Okay. I, I I mean that's how that's my interpretation of let's stay and fight this thing is how I would have interpreted that. I mean, I'm a caster. I could have gone further back and just cast something else. You only had to have moved about another 10, 15 feet. So if you. Yeah, but I didn't say it. So. No, I'll give you the opportunity to. It doesn't matter. Fine, I moved. I'm, not, I'm really not trying to kill you in what's probably going to be the only fucking encounter we get through today. <laughs> Fine, I'll move 30 feet then back. Okay. So that means you're. That means no, not back. 20 feet not away. You should, you should be right up on me. Yeah. You should be right up on me at that point. Yes. Yeah. So it should, with its movement speed, it'll be twenty feet away. Yes, it it will it will be at at ranged, it, it within within uh, close range. What's the most range damage for I range. can do in one turn? <sighs> Are there any? It's 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 moving. That's its turn, right? Yeah, it's it's not able to catch up with him if he's if he's moving if he's moving half half speed it's not able to catch up with him. Okay, okay. But again, the rain coming down does seem to feed it, so it's not at a third anymore. Um, I'm going to take the hammer that is in my bag. And with that hammer, I'm going to cast the spell you catapult. Hang, hang, hang on, out of your bag of holding? No, just my bag bag. I just, oh, okay. okay. Hold that bitch out so I can catapult it. Okay. Um, Cause I don't want, I don't feel like I'd be able to find any rocks or anything, so. Uh, <sighs> give me a deck save. <laughs> hey, you found one. Uh, that nineteen. Me, that was me. That was me being funny. I'm like, oh. no, you trip over one that's suitable for your purpose. Woo! Uh, okay, I need a Dex fifteen save from the water elemental. Dex fifteen. Uh, uh, that's going to be a twelve, so it fails. Yes. All right. Um, is, is this your your casting catapult? The uh, second level catapult, yes. Does that turn it into a magical projectile or just a projectile? It doesn't say. I don't know. Um, 
I'm going to put that to your description. Uh, re read me what it says. Uh, choose one object weighing between uh, one to two, five pounds within range that isn't being worn or carried. Uh, the object fly. Oh, I guess I didn't have to find anything. I could literally just I'll be right back. Um, if other flies in a straight line up to 90 feet in a direction you choose before falling to the ground, stopping early if it impacts against a solid surface. Is, I, I guess it boils down to is it force or bludgeoning damage? Um, it is bludgeoning damage. So I guess okay. not. I, I would say it was. It would. It would be. If it was magical, it would have been force. Okay. So I'm gonna roll my roll dice, and then I'm gonna have anyway. So we'll, we'll, are we'll. you just about to like fucking Thor this hammer right into the water elemental? I did Thor this hammer into the water elemental. Yes. yes. Only problem is I'm not getting it back. So <laughs> I hope I don't need. I hope I don't need to build a new robot because. And, and and you better hope that it doesn't catch up to you because guess what? It's gonna retain it. <laughs> And is going to is and is now going to be circling around when it tries to whelm you again. Um, God. <clears throat> uh, wow, these rolls suck. Uh, fifteen. I rolled a one and a two on two of my d eights. So fifteen is your damage roll. Yeah, yeah. If if if, if elementals could laugh, it it laughs. Yeah. That. The fuck did I miss? Um, I rolled fifteen on four d eight. <laughs> Oh my god. God. And, yeah. and that's hand. Yeah. Um, so my dog hasn't moved yet. It, it's still in lockstep with uh Yeah. Or no, or does it move on your turn? It, 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 it takes its action on my turn. It goes okay, so immediately after I do. So it's now okay, so then I take that back. The elemental would have attacked the dog. Yes, you could attack the dog, yes. Okay. Uh, that it goes immediately after I do. Yeah. Uh, so. Question is, how pissed off is it at the other guy for it's killing? Not, it's not worrying about the dog. No, it's not. It doesn't give a shit. Okay. Okay. That's, that makes sense. Okay, so um, I'm going to have the dog move up to it because I'm assuming it passed it at that point. No, it, it, it's it's basically where the dog, it would surround the dog if it was staying. Perfect. Okay. So I'm going to have the dog attack. It's my bonus action. Okay. <laughs> Does it nap on itself? What happened? It's it rolled in at one. I don't know what you wanted to do. Um, there's it, nothing else in range. The, 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 dog break, the dog breaks. What? It's got. 36 it, hit points. It, it, it bites itself, so it, it, its jaw falls off. The dog breaks. It's, um, it's, it can still move. It, it lost its bite attack. It uses its its rending with its claws. Oh, okay. Then it's, then it can't walk anymore. Now it's a tripod. Uh, I have to go fix some shit. Um, you don't have a hammer. Your hammer. Yeah, oh, wait. He has force him. damage. Yeah, so I guess he is, just for future reference, he has magical because he's using force damage. So. Oh, okay. That works. Um, I say to Antonio, yo, we got to go back. <laughs> After it's dead. Meanwhile, meanwhile, moving forward, your companions, since we since we essentially had like three turns where they haven't done much, uh, I mean, we do have some arrows coming, but uh, we're going to go ahead and just cut screen. Talia, you actually arrive at a door. Okay. Is it locked? Uh, it's It's this building where you were it's this building you were headed towards uh and you you believe someone's probably home do you want to just try and try the door or do you want to knock i mean is, like what kind of building is it like a house it, or? As, as, as it's getting it's a little hard to see your vision's still scared through the water but it's a very large ornate gothic uh type structure uh it's it's for lack of a better word a castle hey fuck it i go in uh, door's I'm gonna locked. try the door. Okay. Yeah, door, door, door's locked. <laughs> uh, Kick that bitch. No, nah, bitch. Eat that bitch open. Can I punch it so hard that it opens? <laughs> uh, it was the door made open. You, you can certainly try. What is, what's the door's AC? <laughs> uh, it's it's easy to hit. Uh, it's but it's it's steel. So go ahead. Oh, it's steel. Fuck me. 
Um, is there like an open window nearby that I can uh, scramble through? Uh, they, you know, you do notice a rope that seems to be attached to what would essentially be some sort of a, a ringer if you were to try to get someone's attention. Oh, okay. I'll ring the doorbell. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> no, fuck that. Just eat the door open. It's steel. <laughs> I can melt it later on. All I hear are fucking excuses. Elements. If you Shut had brought the cleric with you, he could have gone. Dog. He could have gone. <laughs> burning hand. We just melted that bitch open. All I hear is two other dead companions. Also, good news. <laughs> yeah. I don't need the hammer. I need the smith's tool. So fuck that hammer. I don't give a shit about it. Uh, okay, I want to ring the doorbell. Okay. Really, uh, really hard. <laughs> You give it. You give it a good. Okay, get, actually, give me a strength check. Then, if you're giving it a good, oh old, if you're giving it a good rub and tug. That bitch off the wall. Yes. Uh, rub and tug. <laughs> that's an eight. That's an eight strength check. Okay, oh you don't success. You, you successfully don't break it. <laughs> uh, but it, you you hear uh, everyone else. Give me a perception check. Nat twenty. Nat twenty. I'm not. I'm not even fucking oh, with you right now. Okay. Uh, yeah. You. You hear a bell. The direction that you're headed. Uh, very. Very clearly ringing out. Uh, uh, how. How long do you want to wait for a response? Uh. I don't know. Like two seconds. <laughs> I'm impatient. <laughs> two. Two seconds. There's. There's. There's no. No movement. No stirring. You don't. You don't notice. Um. It. God, I'm gonna punch the door open. Okay, you can certainly try. What do you mean? Do you mean to do? Can I use? Okay, is this like an attack roll? Yeah, it'll be, it'll be an attack. The door has an AC of four. Okay, well that is a nineteen. Congratulations, you hit the broadside of a barn. <laughs> <laughs> Really hoping for one there. Just go. Ah, ah, ah <laughs> shit! You missed the door. And Mini the monk. <laughs> That's what they called me in high school. All right. Uh, and, so and does the door open? With a nineteen, uh, you're not able to dislodge it from the hinges. You're you're uh, 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 actually with a nineteen. I'm going to say that you're able to do it swiftly enough that you don't actually fracture any of the bones in your hand. So good yeah. there. If you would have rolled below for, below 10, I would have said that you would have actually, you would have basically lost your weapon. But uh, no, no, you, you notice a dent. I just dented it. Uh, I, I mean, roll damage just to confirm, but. Oh, that is an unarmed strike. It's magical. Does that matter? Uh, it, it it's force damage, though not not uh, uh, la laser steel penetration, right? Uh, yeah, it's just unarmed strike, so it's nine damage. Okay. Uh, you want, do you want to try for flurry of blows? <laughs> <laughs> Do it. No. Do, it. Do, it. It. do it. Do it. Do it. Okay, I'm gonna do it. Yeah. Oh, I get. Wait, I get two attacks. So I'm gonna use my extra attack now. I'm gonna roll again. Okay, okay that is a fifteen. Okay. So do you mean to roll more damage? <clears throat> punch, punch right next to the latch. Don't punch in the middle of the door. Punch near where the doorknob would be. I'm striking strategically wherever okay. I need to strike strategically. That's oh, okay. That, that that brings the AC up to six. Okay. But I got a I got a fifteen. It, yeah, it was it was okay. four. Now it's now it's a six. Do I need so. do I need to roll more damage? Uh, for the second one, yeah, that'll hit two. Okay. So that's gonna be uh <laughs> Oh wait, no, D6, sorry. That was the wrong die. Uh nine damage. Okay. And then I'm gonna use flurry of blows to do two more unarmed strikes. Okay. Okay, so then I guess I have to roll twice. Okay, so that is an 18. Okay. And that is a 
20 something, uh, oh. 21, a 21. The 21, uh, you, you, your strategic uh, placement of these, of this, of this just quick flurry of, of fists found it, found the, uh, the, 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 weak point port, the, 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 the peephole port. You were, oh. you, God, I didn't ever get And there's somebody the looking through there, isn't there? Please tell me there's somebody <laughs> looking through. Please tell me there's somebody uh, looking through. I am. <laughs> just did, like he's got his eye right up to it and just. <laughs> <laughs> he, he opens the door, he's just got a bruise like this. Uh, there is someone there. Your, your, your face doesn't connect, but as you pull back, you do notice a rather shaken looking individual. <laughs> Uh, hey, let me into your house. <laughs> There's some water, water elementals out here. We need in. Let me in. Let me in. I, <laughs> I'm in. This is the memes. <laughs> he's seeing as he, he's going to feel like he wouldn't have much of a choice in the matter. Wait, wait, wait. <sighs> if you don't let me in, I'm going to break your door down. So, I mean, we can do door, this. Door, 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 swings, door swings out. Oh, my God. <laughs> I hate it so much. <laughs> so he's he's waiting for you to step back enough for him to open it. Okay, I'll move backwards so he can open his door. <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, we'll we'll come back to that. Uh, uh, meanwhile, uh, uh, Dan, Dan, what have you been doing during this time? Are you st have you been trying to engage in combat, or have you been trying to close the distance? What are you trying to do? Uh. Can I close the distance in the amount of turns that we've taken? Uh, you will, I, I will say that you will have, you will be meeting up to her right now if you weren't attacking, if you weren't stopping to attack. Okay, so I'm, <clears throat> I personally am running towards the door. I'm closing the distance. However, my bird is going to strike. He's going the distance. Okay. I'm uh, going for speed. What, what, is, what is the range at which you can go. the bird? The range of what? At, at which you can command the bird. There we go. Uh, I... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, that was it. Or, or, That's or, the or, or is there one? Am I? Am I? Uh, I don't think there is one. I feel like there should be. It does. Or, I will look it up well, on well, beyond. This, this would be something. This, but you would have just you would have trained him adequately. I would say that. You won't be able to give him commands at this distance, but he would be able to follow the last one given to the best of his ability. <clears throat> All right. So, I mean, just, so he would have to be able to hear you. You're giving verbal commands. Right. So if you're telling him to attack this thing, he's going to keep attacking it and he's not going to return to you until it's dead or he's dead. Well, I'm not doing that. So I'm just closing the distance then. Okay. Well, I'll, I'll I'll give you the first one. I'll give you the first one, you, and you can tell him to attack. And then after that, if you want him to keep, if he, if you move on without telling him to come back to you, you that's the gamble that you're going to take. So yeah, I'll, give no, you, I'll, I'm give, not, I'll give you this. I'll give you this first one easy. Um, I mean, if he's not going to be able to come back, if I, I mean, can I tell the bird attack once and then get your ass back here? Well, well that, that's 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 what I'm that's what I'm clarifying now. Is this, oh yeah, this, yeah, yeah. This one you can have you can have the free one, and then next okay. turn. You don't tell him, give him another instruction. He'll be out of earshot. Okay, so my bird's name is Soren, by the way. So I tell Soren to... Over California? <laughs> I tell Soren to attack once and then get back here. Okay, okay. So uh, so he's going to, you're basically giving him the attack and follow command. Yep. Oh. Okay. That is an eight, so I'm going to go with no. An eight to attack, that's going to miss. So question. Uh -huh. He flew wide. Dogs can still run with three legs, right? Not this one. Uh, it, it, it's whole weights and measures. Uh, uh, it, it's it's uh, balanced. Yeah, because right, this one yeah. is clockwork. It's, I'm gonna, it's, it, it, there's some internal component. Yeah, sorry. No. Fuck, I got to go hit Mending on it then. We got to go get the dog. Antonio, we got to get the dog. I know we got to get the dog. Let me just bless the motherfucker first. Do it. Fucking do it. Fine. Is it my turn yet, Blake? Uh, yes, that that'll bring us back to you guys. And blasting the motherfucker as a cautionary tale. 
Uh, do it. I can fix it. <laughs> What's what what fine. AC do I need? Be in the blast radius. I can fix him. It's fine. I can use mending on him. You, you don't have your hammer. I don't need my hammer. I have Smith tools. Biat. What's what AC do I need to hit? Uh, fourteen is the elemental. Oh yes. So three hits from scorching ray. Woo! God, this is gonna take a while. Do you do, you do more than ten damage? Yeah. Already. Okay, yes. Yeah, Woo! Yeah, yeah, elemental's done. All right. All right. Go grab. Go uh, right. tend to your doggo. Right, go hit him with mending, and he. Oh my god, I find the actual thing. Uh, it repairs them. Yeah, it, it, it'll it'll attach the leg again, but it won't repair the, the magical component that was actually making it mobile. Can so I... now it's got a dead leg instead of a no leg. Oh, that's fine. I'll fix him later. Can you he build goes. him a wheel? Can you take a wheel from the cart and put it Yeah, there? can I just go grab a cart and just like bolt it to him so he has like a little wheel? Uh, size, your, your proportions are going to be a little bit off. Yeah, fuck it. Who cares? I'll fix him later. Well, yeah, he can just drag a dead off, leg. I need a lot of it off. He can drag a dead leg. Okay, so you you go and collapse. Um, you're collecting a collapsed dog. Who's question. Trying to, he's question. trying to army crawl towards you. A question. Um, sure. So if the dog dies, I can mend it and revive it within one minute. I get it, I hit mending and then it revives after a minute. Would that fix the foot? Fix the leg? Uh, you're gonna have to take some time to kill it first. Ah, uh, fuck it. Uh, Sweep the leg, Johnny. <laughs> can I spend like a couple turns fixing him to actually make I it? Mean, you, we're out of we're out of combat. You can do what you want. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna spend some time to actually right. fix him. I'm gonna go over and cast light by dent so that he has some. Uh, oh, I can do light. That's fine. Actually, you know what? This is a courtesy thing. I'm gonna cast dark vision on myself so I can actually fucking see what I'm doing. How many spell slots do you have? Left? That's my second second level spell slot. Okay. I only have two. That's the last one. Uh, I, I only use one spell the entire fight. <clears throat> okay. I, oh yeah, the catapult. Yeah. Yeah, no, Antonio was one of the casting like fireball and all that other crap. Hey, I only use two actual spell slots. Everything else is cantrip. No, three Fair spells. Fair enough. Yeah, yeah. Um, <clears throat> but I have like 10 spell slots total, so. Yeah, I have uh, six. Yeah, and I got a hemorrhoid on my ass that's starting to act up. Let's wrap this up. Uh, How'd that go with Rhett being used as a pogo stick earlier, though? I, I, I'm looking forward to round two. Um, <laughs> So you you shorthand over it. You collect the dog. I fix it's, him. Your, it, it's it's in your bag of holding. Okay, I put it in my bag of holding for now. There we go. That works. Yes, shorthand it up, and then you proceed to where the direction that you would assume your companions were headed. Can I see the house now that I have dark vision? You can probably uh, you hear can, the yeah, now, you can, now you can make out the outline of it through the. <laughs> oh yeah, I probably heard the ringing and the fucking boxing match against the door. It will. Yeah, your your echolocation sense is able to tell you exactly the outline of the building. <laughs> but yes, you, you, you can see that you're you're still probably a couple couple minutes. Uh, well, you, you just cast dark vision on yourself, didn't you? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Can I actually see it now? Oh, I, can, okay. I, I can. I know. I'm just saying that you know yeah. you, she she hit that thing pretty hard. So, so if I can there see, is, with... there, there is an audible ringing. You can tell so... where you're supposed to be going without without issue. What you're saying mm -hmm. is I'm daredevil now. All right, that's cool. cool. No, bad, bad, man. Because you're not blind anymore. Daredevil has the echo, echo location. Yeah, but yeah, but you're not blind anymore. But Daredevil's Whatever. blind. Whatever. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but that's why you're not Daredevil anymore, is because <laughs> you're not blind. You're better than him. Okay. I cover my eyes and go, ah! You can, all, you can use both senses. Some, some people, some people use all, 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 all seven. The seventh one is everyone's naturally occurring Christopher Walken impression for those of you at home. You're expecting you, to do an impression there, weren't you? No, no, I'm, I'm, expect, I'm expecting you to tell me what you're doing. Are you trying to Heading tell towards the house? Wait, wait, wait. I should Thank cast you. fireball at it. This is the guy who opened the door. So are you telling us that we need to shove a watch up our ass? Is that what you're saying? Well, it doesn't have to be a watch. It, it just has to be an uncomfortable hunk of metal. 
We just need to make sure to get it back to the, our compatriots kid. Yes. In 20 years. Yes. So that he can then have it when he goes to not rig a boxing make match. Sure, make sure you wash it off after you die of this. No. That make just make sure, it, like that just makes it weird. Well, see, at that point, he throws it at the gimp to discuss the gimp. Exactly. Exactly. Uh, bad, bad news. Gimp puts into that. Rolling that 20. Sorry. Shit. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, that, that would be involved, yes. You're headed towards the door. Yes. Back, back yes. to the door. We're headed towards the loud ass bell and fucking banging on the door. Yeah, I, I would be curious as hell what that what that is exactly and why. I'm so resisting the there. urge to f cast fireball at the building, but yeah. I think that they're sending an alarm at our compatriots and we should go in and bust in a bitch and save them. I think yeah, you should very, fireball. A very logical response. I think you should fireball. I mean, that's just like the logical answer. I think you should fireball. Maybe in like 28 minutes or so. <laughs> We're in the tower. You drop fireball. Danger <laughs> close. <laughs> Cutting AI. Talk about Frank losing control. I have enough constitution to survive most fireball casts. Uh, rocks fall. Everyone dies. Yeah, but like Good night, you, everyone. You're in the tower. Okay. Going back, I have the, going back to the tower. Going back to the door. Uh, I can't catch you say tower. <laughs> uh, uh, Talia, you notice you notice your uh, your your are, are, are your characters actually related? Yes, they're twins. Okay, so you you notice your brother uh, approaching you as as the door swings open. Wait, so we're 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 back with them at this point. No, no, this is this is occurring as you're collecting. Oh, it's these two. Correct. Okay, gotcha. Gotcha. Wait, hold on. These two. So I can do it in the I, right I, direction. I don't, I, I don't have the diagram drawn. Okay. Uh, the door opens. Uh, on, on the other side is a rather gaunt looking uh, a gentleman in a, a, a very pale complexion with a platinum blonde skullet. And uh, he, he basically says, he just goes, hello. Uh, <laughs> that's me, I'm supposed to talk. <laughs> hello there. <laughs> hello. Uh, there's some water elementals outside your uh, house. And um, yeah, you, yes, to come inside. You, you, you're all you're all wet. Yeah, because of the water elementals well, that I, are outside I, your house. I, I think, so I we're think, gonna come inside. You don't really I, have a choice. I think we're perhaps coming in. better both come inside. Okay, so I go inside. Just yeah. ignore, he just ignores the fact that you threatened him. Is it Friday <laughs> night already? Exactly. Uh, so uh, he's. It encourages you to follow behind him and this way, and uh, you you take you take a look around into basically the foyer of this of this gothic manor. Wait a second, is the thing you're adapting Rocky Horror Picture Show? Yes, that's yes. Where I, you spent so fucking long doing the rain. <laughs> I got it. I got it on the first scene. Yes. You were you you're coming from a wedding, going to go see your old mentor. Yes. <laughs> I can't believe I didn't catch on oh to this. God. I'm so mad now. <laughs> I must be the only person here who uh your car, has your car broke down. <laughs> it it took I will admit it took me a while, but like it's raining. Wait. It's raining. You're it's adapting raining. something and we're coming in from the rain to a spooky castle. Yes. <sighs> Anyway, well, you're fucking with your dog still. Anyways, yeah, no, I put him in the bag. He's fine. Yeah, well, no, that, that, but I'm telling you, that's happening. He's like, he's like, uh, you know, those... chronologically, these are happening at yeah, the same. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Time. He's like, you know, those. You know how the rich people have the little uh, toy dogs hanging out of their purse. That's him, but his head's a he's a he's a Rottweiler. So no, that, that, that doesn't that doesn't happen in this universe. Damn it. Uh, so, <laughs> so, 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 uh, uh, oh. Uh, Woof woof. Uh, I still got it. <laughs> who identifies himself as the uh, as the butler uh, of the manor? 
uh, informs you that it's a, it's a rather uh, special night that you've arrived. Uh, we're having a party. So I will have to uh, go and uh, check on things uh, and and uh, let the master know of your arrival so that he can come and greet you properly. Uh, how, what, what do you do? Do you continue to look around this? Uh, how, what, what, are, what are you doing while he's talking to you? Are you following? What's going on? Talia? I am still passing without a trace. In, in, in a very well-lit uh, foyer because you, you, are, you are with her as, as, they, uh, as he opens the door. Question, do they have uh, newspapers on top of their head? Uh, that would be a question for them. Do you have newspapers on top of your head? Keep you dry? Uh, did we even have newspaper access to newspapers? They were in the cart and you didn't actually acquire any of the items from your cart because you ran before as the as the rain began. No, I don't have newspapers up my Damn it, Janet. <laughs> so uh, what what are what are you doing in here? Uh, how how are how are you interacting? What's going on? Are you taking a look around? But what's going on? I am looking to see if there's anything of value. Okay, uh, give me a perception here. Give me an investigation because you're going to okay. be looking specifically for something. Uh, are you doing this? Are you waiting until he leaves or are you just scoping the place right now? I'm doing it very stealthily. Okay. That's a 14 investigation. Uh, you you notice that the uh, the pendulum in the uh, in in the clock uh, seems to glow uh, a little bit more than you would expect for something like uh, traditional copper or brass. Break it and steal it. It's glowing. It. Uh, it, it it has a different different kind of a shine to it than what you would expect. Hmm. It's mithril. Break it and steal it. It's made, it's made out. It's made out of gold. Is what I'm saying. Is it's, basically okay. It's, it's gold. Break it and steal it. Okay. Uh, um, is he, is his back turned, has he left yet? He's, he's, yeah, so you're doing that as he's like, because he's he's not looking around to make sure you're following. He's just basically, he told you what you were supposed to do and if you don't do it, that's your fault at that point. Uh, so okay. he's, he, he's, uh, uh, as, as he's getting ready to leave, he's just, one moment, please, and then he he, he does he, he disappears off, and the two of you are left alone, effectively in the foyer. Okay. When he leaves, I'm going to stealthily break into the grandfather clock and try to steal the pendulum. Give me a stealth check. Yes, because I'm. You have plus it. ten to Dex on stealth checks too. No way, no, no, you don't. No, because I wasn't in the range. You're the only the one range. who doesn't. Womp womp. Okay. Sure. That's a twenty-five. Okay. Uh, you very stealthily move over to the grandfather clock and- I think you're gonna make a slight uh, of hand on- Roll, give me a d20. Right? Give me a, a d20. d20? Just, just straight up d20. Just straight up 15? No, 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 I take that back. D12, because it's a d12. clock. Because it's a clock. Okay, uh, where's my d12? I got two d12s. So that's a nine. Guess what, it's nine o'clock. <laughs> ah. There is a very as as you as you reach your hand in to collect it, a, a nine chimes ring out uh from the from the direction of here, uh startling you, but you're able to go in and well, I take that back. You 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 collect it and only seven chimes ring out, even though it's nine o'clock. You broke the clock, way to go. What I'm here for. You're an artifice, or you fix it. I'm not there. Uh, at, you guys oh, fucked yeah, off right. about this. I'm not there. At this, at, at huh. this you notice you notice some a stirring uh, on the banister nearby. Uh, as a uh, very a, a very again very uh, pale looking woman in uh, basically a maid's outfit uh, 
who you didn't notice before as you were previously uh, investigating the room, makes her presence known and is fully aware that you just broke the clock. Uh, she seems fairly indifferent because she's basically fucking the banister at this point. She's pre she's otherwise preoccupied. Is the banister also a pogo stick? <laughs> <laughs> no, it, no, but it's giving her splinters. Um, but, but she, uh, but, but she, but she does, splinter. she does start wow. with her, with, with, uh, with her, uh, with her presence because it's it's a very loud uh, almost like a cackle uh is how she finds she finds you breaking that very amusing or she finds something occurring very amusing so she's not she doesn't really seem to care she's letting you pocket it magenta don't give a shit she informs you that you're very lucky i'm am i i'm also inside Yes, yes, you, you, you've, you've been uh, having opportunities to look around and everything while she was fucking with the clock. Oh, great. Well, I'm going to look around for some... Uh, I'm going to look around for some valuables as well. Okay, uh, same thing. Investigation, please. Fifteen. Fifteen. Uh, you find uh, on the wall... Uh, you noted you noticed that uh, one of the one of the uh, picture frames on the wall there's a little sparkle behind it at the top and bottom almost as if it were on a hinge you think there might be something behind it oh <clears throat> well i'm gonna saunter on over there and uh saunter stealthily by the way over there and see if i can open swing whatever okay. the frame yeah, yeah, it's 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 a picture of a rather stern-looking man and woman uh, holding farm implements. Uh, oh. it, it very easily is able to. Uh, it, it it is. It's on a hinge. It just behind it there is a uh, effectively a padlock safe. Hmm. And again, uh, the woman on the banister does not seem to be particularly perturbed by this. <laughs> Um, I am, I'm going to tell my hawk to try to dive bomb the padlock. Mm. Okay, I'll, I'll, it, it, it'd, it'd go up the stairwell where the maid is and have to dive from that direction. So it'll go out of view and come back. But yeah, I, I would say that there's enough space in, the, in this interior structure to be able to do that. Uh, it's solid brass. That's a nat 20 to attack. Uh, oh, okay. Your bird uh, is able to, uh, not, it, I, I was going to make him, uh, he was going to break his beak, but uh, he's actually smart enough to fry it apart using his claws as he's diving into it. We're going to spend just enough time to kill those elementals and come in and loot the in entryway to Frankenfurter's castle. <laughs> Yeah, are, 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 are yeah, this is why we can't have nice things. <laughs> <laughs> Would we be murder hobos if we could have nice things? That yeah, well, no, what I'm disappointed in myself with is to continue actually trying to continue on with the story after the first hour. <laughs> uh, uh, okay, well, I open the. I open whatever is back there. No, your your bird opens it. <laughs> I'm sorry, the bird, very proud of himself, opens it. Yes, uh, and and he does. He 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 successfully tears 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 the 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 shackle off of the lock, and it it falls to the ground. That there's really nothing else keeping this latched. It it kind of opens on its own, and he goes to perch on the now silenced clock nearby. Cool. Uh, What's inside? Inside. Inside, you find uh, uh, three uh, uh, almost oh, no. uh, 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 cylindrical objects uh, oh, with uh, with with a narrow end and a wider end uh, that 
seem to have uh, different uh, different capabilities to them. Uh, uh, you 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 found the dildo stash. Oh my god, I knew it. <laughs> I was Dan literally there. just messaged me magic vibrators like two seconds before he said that. <laughs> Not I was gonna make that as a comment, but I felt that be <laughs> Yes, uh, there is there, there is one there there is one marked Friday, there is one marked Saturday, and there is one marked any day. Okay, I close that door and put the painting back where it was. Do you collect these no, items? Or, no, no. Yes, yes. He collects the <laughs> items and then treasures them for the rest of his life. The bird is very interested in the in the intricate silicone that is in the is in the ball <laughs> Fantasy silicone. It's a very highly polished mahogany. The uh, bird is very oh. distracted by the very high pile of highly polished. Oh, they're mahogany. wood. I actually have woodworker's tools, so I am going to take those. So, yes, so they're, they're very highly polished, highly polished. One, one is cherry, one is mahogany, and one is maple. So what you're saying is Which ones they which have thing? wood. Uh, any day is maple, uh, mahogany is Friday, and cherry is for Saturdays. It's so Friday. Saturday smells of rich mahogany. Uh, and all right, I'm actually, I am going to take all three of those. Okay. Uh, I so you, get would the that, you would get the impression that they They're magical. They, 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 you get the impression Plus that maybe, 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 maybe there's a, maybe there's a reason they're in the state. <laughs> and so, I ignore that. No, well, no. So I'm saying you might want to have someone identify these as well. Is what I'm. Is the hey, okay. I can identify magical dildos. <laughs> So you're saying you're an expert in it? Yes, I'm <laughs> saying that I am an I am an expert in all things magical, especially when it comes to identifying magical dildos. I'll have you know that after the war, I worked as a dildo manufacturer. <laughs> or, or at least a tester. I thought you were an artificer, not yes, a Yes, I made them. I am a master craftsman. I worked for a guild who made dildos. Is it is it called a dildo? It's called the, the big dildo, yes. Yes, good. It better be. If it if it wasn't, I would be disappointed. I can look okay, for the maker's so, mark. So <laughs> you, 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 with with your stash of of as yet unidentified <laughs> uh, phallic objects, uh, uh, your 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 other companion <laughs> arrived at the door, which which was left ajar because you followed him in and didn't close it like dirty animals. Uh, so uh, do you guys? Go in there. There, there's. You approach the door. There's a crack. It's. It seems see to be an or, or, ornately lit uh, foyer. Sure. And, and and you can see your companions. In, what in the, the fuck, guys? How's it going? We just fought the fucking elementals. Can I offer you a dildo in this trying time? <laughs> can you affix it to a mace? Wait, wait, <laughs> wait. Let me see that dildo. <laughs> I like to, I'd like to check for a maker's mark on the dildo. I uh, uh, there there is it says maker's mark. This is a very high quality dildo. You should be oh, very proud. You. I am wow. This is the most valuable thing I've ever stolen in my life. <laughs> I'm going to take a and now we're back. Let's go. <laughs> I'd like to take a page out of Prudence's book and smell it. Oh oh oh, oh okay um. It smells faintly of insect carapace. Well, that's I, more disturbing than what I was imagining. Um, <laughs> I would like to actually burn a spell slot to identify the one that I was. Uh, um, it's a wand of web. <laughs> <laughs> it's a what? A wand of web. Because <laughs> because of, of the semen. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'd like. Do you have any more? I'd like to see what other kind of fun things you have. I, I have. I have these three that I just found. My my hold my my, my art, Warforce can't wink for else. There's like wink. I can hear the the gears whirring as he's trying to make <laughs> you it see, happen. Like, he's very slowly going wink. <laughs> I show I show him all three 
just to I identify all the other two. Let's go. Uh, Both slots. Let's do it. One, one. Uh, the, uh, the the mahogany was the wand of uh, web. Uh, cherry is uh, a wand of smiles because that's the giggle stick. Um, and uh, the oak is uh, the it, it's it's a wand of wonder. It's a wand of wonder. Uh, I was gonna. I was hoping you yeah, said wand of enlargement. <laughs> mm, mm. No, 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 no. There's a little blue pill somewhere in the manor for that. <laughs> So you have effectively found three magical wands, question mark. You have three lovely magical wands. Here you go. Oh, thank and you. By, and yeah. by magical wand, I mean like the Hitachi magic wand. Yes. <laughs> yes. You see there's a switch at the bottom. That's how you activate it. So uh, after, about the time that you're done looting the toy toy cabinet ludo um you notice that uh, uh wolf wolf uh wolf, wolf wolf uh reappears and uh after leering at the person humping the banister a bit too long uh uh di directs you uh in into the next room Sure, I follow him. Fuck it. I say hello. We haven't met yet. Nice to meet you. Hello. Good. He doesn't. He doesn't. He, doesn't he, he, he avoids contact with you. But he, a big old he, pat on the back. He, he acknowledges your presence, but seems unsurprised by it. Uh, you you I, mean the hump? Yes. Yes. Okay. I'm just gonna go. Fuck it. We're gonna go full full in on this. Let's go. Yeah. He's and he's he's uncomfortable at your touch. Yes. Uh, but again, doesn't act in a hostile way. Just it tries to uh, try, try tries to shy away from it. But uh, if you're proceeding forward into the next uh, what I'm going to call room, uh, you notice that it is a very very open uh, uh, chamber, uh, seems like a ballroom, uh, where you notice a, mem a number of cultists uh, uh, standing around in very fancy dress. Hi, everybody. Hi, Dr. Nick. There we go. Uh, does everyone follow him? Yeah. Yep. OK. Uh, Follows, yeah. There's there's a brief musical interlude. They sing the time warp. Yeah. Uh, While they're doing that, can I look around for any valuables? Absolutely, because they are too focused on what they're doing to really be too concerned about what you're doing. Do I need to do another investigation check? Damn skippy. I stand there awkwardly cool. like Brad did. Uh that's 16. In here, you notice uh that. Off to the side, there is a very, very extravagant buffet table laid out uh, with some more unusual foods. Uh, uh, but in an, in amongst them, uh, you notice that there seem to also be some unopened party poppers. Uh, that party poppers? <laughs> I'll pop all of them. Okay. Uh, roll first. First of all, roll. Uh, give me a d10. Just or okay. Me, yeah. We'll, we'll we'll determine how many there are. Uh, two. <laughs> two. Okay. So there there were only two that the 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 firing mechanism has gone out on some of the others, but there are that you kind of get the impression that maybe that's why they're in this pile over here. You put okay, one but, here. And but, one here. Just. But there are two that uh, do seem to fire. Uh, and they're going to function as the loot scrolls. So I happen to have a couple in my bag. Let me go grab them. Yay! Wait, I have some immediately right next to me. Hold on. Oh, okay. I gotta grab them. Hold on. Immediately right next to me. 
you're going to get two, two, two uh, immediate effects occur, uh, basically whatever he pulls out of that bag. Okay. Do, 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 do. Where are my scrolls? <laughs> Uh, while, while he's looking for that, uh, there they I, are. I found them. Okay. Um, here, pick one, two, three, four, or five. I have Me? five of them. Yes. Five and two. Five and two. All right, number two. Uh, you read for the next. All right, reader sings for the next ten minutes, so you have to speak in song. Uh, and because of the and because of the situation, I'm going to say you are also immediately imbued with the knowledge of the song that's going on. Man. You've never heard it before. I'm going to skip that one because it kind of it kind of destroys the scene. Oh, this is fun. Uh, scroll reader must speak like Foghorn Leghorn for the rest of the day or take one D four damage. So you are singing like Foghorn Leghorn. <laughs> Not know how to talk like Foghorn Leghorn. I say, I say, I say, do the time warp again. It, it, yeah, it's C Colonel Sanders mixed with a little bit more racism. Think of like a stereotypical Southern plantation owner. Jesus that's, Christ. That's well, I'm just not going to talk for the next three minutes. That's fine. <laughs> well, except that, that was for the rest of the day, I think. No, she's saying it's almost 10 o'clock. Oh. oh, I have an unopened one. Hold on. Let me, I'm going to open this one. Okay, but it doesn't go into effect. I know. Oh, okay. oh this is a good one. I, Why did I It's uh, back with Tamlin. Oh, hold on. I can fix that. Well, let, let's let's just let's yeah. let's wrap this up. No, keep going. Okay. So uh, was anyone else taking a look around while all of this commotion is happening around you? Oh yeah. That's a really good one. I'm just um, confounded and seriously considering that fireball again. Do it! <laughs> do, do it! Fireball the time warp! Come on! I'm pretty self-satisfied. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yet. Yes, you are. Yes, because you left your bags and everything's still on the cart. So if you're if you're hiding those on your person, there's only one way to do it. <laughs> <laughs> Joke's on you. I actually mentioned bringing my bags. <laughs> are they, are they oh. properly beveled? Or is he uh, going to need to see a doctor? I was going to say, I'm like, do, does uh, upon closer examination, do they feel anatomically correct? <laughs> they cut off at a certain point. Oh. Uh, is there a chandelier in the room? Yes, very, very large, ornate one. Is the is the area above the chandelier wooden? Uh, no, you, this all seems to mostly be stonework. <sighs> Yes. I'm gonna end it off on a bang. Uh, it's like if 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 uh, fucking Brad and Janet had a rocket launcher. Thirty-three damage to everyone in the center within twenty feet of that. Uh, so where so where are you aiming? I guess is my question because this is a vaulted. This is a pretty high ceiling in this room. I'm aiming towards the center of the uh, uh, of, of, of the floor. I'm going to say like like right above everyone's heads in the center of the room. Okay. Because uh, what's what's the area on this? Twenty radius. Twenty radius. Okay. So yeah, it's yeah 40, 40 feet total. Okay. Yeah, you'll you'll miss barely the floor and the ceiling. But you'll catch everything in between them. So you're 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 basically hitting everything except the actual structure with that. Yep. Uh, and can I, please, can I please have a description on the effects of uh, the giggle stick and the wand of wonder? <laughs> oh, oh, uh, the wand of smiles. Uh, you pointed at someone, and they are take overtaken with a very uncomfortable and painful looking smile. Okay. Well, I'm gonna point that at Antonio. And uh, go ahead and do that. My all. <clears throat> uh, and the wand of wonder. Uh, give me a give me a percentile. Uh, is that the D one hundred? It is a D one hundred and a D ten. Or well, yeah, D one hundred is fine if it's if he's got oh, a one hundred. Oh, you actually have a D one hundred. Yeah, yeah. No, Sorry. I don't have a D one hundred, but I I assume so. The one D one hundred is the tens place. Is what yeah, you're saying. I just want to say, Antonio, you're. 
in character. Fuck this revelry. What is going on here? Fuck, fuck uh, this. 34. 34. Okay, let me see here what happens. Uh, an animal appears in the nearest unoccupied space. Uh, for color, I will say that it is a gerbil. So it is. <laughs> And my uh, hawk it, immediately... it, 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 it isn't under your control, so it is acting normally, and its normal is trying to find somewhere to burrow. So it okay, gets well, crushed my... by the rocks from the fucking fireball, basically. My well, no, hawk immediately swoops in and eats the gerbil. Oh. Like, like, it sees it, and it's fucking there. I was about okay. to say, can I use a bonus action to clench? <laughs> can I use a reaction uh, to clench? I was going to say, I'm like, yeah, free actions clench. Yeah, ke ke kegels are a free action because you can do a kegel anytime. I'm doing them now. Uh, so uh, that that gerbil has seen some shit, so it is going to give your bird indigestion, but otherwise be unaffected. Wait, the gerbil's unaffected or the bird's unaffected? The bird, the bird is pretty sure the gerbil's but, affected. The, the bird can taste the fear in the gerbil as it's uh. devouring it, but that's. <laughs> Uh, as for, I, I'm still going, I st I'm still trying to resolve that fireball. Uh, so, uh, being by the buffet table, uh, <clears throat> Talia, you would also be involved in this. The others are still close enough to the door that that's not going to be an issue. No, oh, motherfuckers. Uh, so I'm gonna, still alive. Question. I'm gonna, Can I give Antonio a high five after he fireballs the ceiling? Uh, let me resolve it first, please. Okay. Okay. Uh, no, I'm fireballing right above everyone's heads. Well, no, they well, went well, in the well, room. Well, me and well, you were well, still at the no, doorway. No, by by doing above everyone's heads, in the size of this room, you're also hitting everyone, the rest of everyone as well, because it's only about forty-two feet tall. I'm willing to take that risk. So, so yeah, that, and that's what I said. You're encompassing basically everything in this room except for the outer perimeter of the of the structure itself. So yeah, that, that's the intent. Yeah. So, so, so you did need a nuke like, above ground for more damage than you do at ground level. It's right. Same thing for airburst. Yes. It's an airburst fireball. Yeah. So, uh, did you roll damage? Yeah, it is. I, uh, I'm sorry, that was so long ago. I think you said thirty-three. It was thirty-three because yeah. I already yeah, subtracted it. Correct. Did, okay, did yeah. you save, uh, Talia? I need to roll a save. What save do I roll? Dex? Uh, yeah, Dex. Oh, yeah. Um, that is a 16. Half damage, then. So... Woohoo! 16. 16. Yeah. Yeah. Take 16 save? damage. Oh yeah, man, I'm so bad at math. And nope. uh, the Transylvanians, who I actually did have stat blocks for, they're uh, nice, cultist nice. fanatics. Uh, I believe have more than uh, I just rolled once. They made their save. What's and the save? Dex, 14. Yeah, Dex 16. Well, no, you, you guys are unaffected. He's casting yeah, it. You're by the up. door. Oh, okay. Yeah, you are right next to each other. So. Entered this room so far in her investigations. Is Talia oh, in the room? I thought I was in the room with her. Yeah. I feel like oh, Talia is oh, with oh, me. Oh, I thought you were. I thought you were still by the door playing with your dildos. No, no, no. The no. Uh, those oh, are. Oh, okay. Then, then, yeah, you make the save too. Okay. Oh, and my bird. Shit. Uh, uh, how many hit points does the bird have? Uh, not enough for that. <laughs> um, hey, yeah. hey, Colonel Sanders, we, we we got we got some Kentucky Fried uh, Falcon for you. I oh say, I say, I want that Falcon. <laughs> uh, what was it? It was a Dex save. Yes, Dex yes. Of fourteen. Yeah, I got a twelve. I'm dead. Okay. Well, I'm unconscious. Yeah, thirty thirty three. Wait, damage. you're dead or the bird is dead? Yes. I'm dead. <laughs> I'm unconscious. Oh, 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 oh. The bird is fucking toast. <laughs> ah, hmm, looks like we're having pheasant for dinner, boys. <laughs> and, looks and, like and, meat's and, back on the menu. I was just going to say we'll, that. And we'll wrap it up there as this fireball does not just destroy any of the Transylvanians, but by God, now you have their attention. And, and you are smoldering on the ground. And... Um, uh, 
question. Alive. Verify him. Uh, question. Uh, before we end, uh, is the point where the chandelier is hanging from the ceiling? How durable is that? Uh, you'd have to give me an investigation check. I just want to catapult it, basically. I have one spell slot left. Uh, what's the distance? What's the range on that? Uh, 60 from, feet. From, that you can pull an object? Oh, no, that's that I can shoot it. I can shoot it 60 feet. And I could pull the object. Because I, you're not going to be able to pull it. You're going to have to aim for it. Is, is... Oh, I guess, I guess the pull is 60 and the range is 90. Okay, then you'll be able wow. to attempt to pull it. Uh, D12 against me. Okay. Slam that shit down. Hell yeah. Eight. Uh, roll again. Five. That's a four. Yes. So y it launches towards you, as as you as you as it, you 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 are you are you are. Think of it your... like it's Half Life Two, and I just use a gravity gun to pull something onto me, and then yes, I'm gonna. Yes, you're, you're, you're having to exert so much force on it to snap the te to snap the chains holding it. Oh in. no 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 no! I'm it's... I'm kind of taking an object and then shooting it at the attachment point of the chandelier. So, so that's Break an aim. It. Shot. That's a, that's an aim shot. Yes. Okay. So, give me give me a uh, give me an attack roll at disadvantage. Uh, should I use my intelligence modifier since it's a spell, or my spell attack modifier? No, it's a called shot, so it's at disadvantage. Yeah, no, I'm saying for the attack modifier though. Use the spell attack modifier. Uh, well, what do, what what is it normally to hit? Is it doesn't that... have a hit. It has a dex save. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I'm not gonna, I'm dead, that's too, uh, yeah, use your intelligence modifier, that's fine. Um, that's a 17. Okay, yeah, you're able to connect with it. How much damage? It's 14 so far. Um, that's 22. That combined with the fireball is enough to uh, 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 successfully uh, break the uh, tether, uh, and it comes crashing down. And I'm going to have to make everyone else make. They make their deck saves. So yes. Like, uh, the cultists are not smashed by the chandelier, but the room goes incredibly dark as a cry brings out from behind you. It turns out the master of the house probably heard that one. I have dark vision. We can leave. Let's. Go. <laughs> I need to make a deck save. Uh, no, that's you're you're far enough off to the buffet table that you're not going to get okay. hit by the chandelier. Uh, your friend is. Did you say that you healed? Uh, uh, your friend Mike. No, I only healed okay. myself earlier. Yeah. Oh, I thought you were getting getting him up. The one that. Duh. I said I can. No. I didn't say I was. No. Okay. Okay. I sorry. I thought I heard. No. I mean, he actually helped out. If you're trying to leave, you'll find your path obscured by a cloaked figure who looks very displeased, and that is where we're going to leave off. Oh darn it! Uh, just because. I can't do, I, I'm like, I'm not about to do sweet transvestite. So, all right, final thoughts. Uh, we'll go around, uh, we'll, we'll go same order we did last time. Uh, uh, assuming that I can remember what order we did last time. Tamlin, final thought. Uh, it probably would have worked better if there was only one water elemental. If you would have encouraged, if you would have heeded my advice and- or, or had like four of them. So then there's literally no chance we could fight that. Or maybe like you, you elected to fuck around with the water elementals. That was your choice. Or maybe okay. like make it to where we can see them coming, but there's no chance we can fight them. So we have to run away. That's what I was trying to tell you. But well, we had a chance. As soon as, you, as soon as you have stat blocks, someone tries to kill it. Final thoughts, Mike. Uh make them immune it. during the rain. There you go. Yeah, that wouldn't be bad. Yeah, well, they, were, they, were, they were healing. I was trying to. I, I wasn't actually doing anything because I was trying to get you guys to leave them alone. 
Come on, you know that doesn't work with us. You know that players are gonna fight if they can fight. Come on. Yeah. And that, and that's why we can't have nice things. Yeah, it is. Know, that's are... why you didn't get to hear the sweet transvestite song. Oh, Sorry. Okay. Fuck them elementals. Yeah, fuck them elementals. In in the voice of Michael Jordan, obviously. Dan, final thoughts. Uh, this is unlike anything I've ever done before. Yay. You're talking about the vibrators, right? Wait, they're vibrating yes. wood? Wait. That's that's another magical component that uh, you didn't get to fully explore when, upon <clears throat> casting. I'll, ta- I'll, I'll take that as a compliment. Rosemary, final thoughts. Uh, I think the idea of adopting Rocky Horror to a D&D one-shot is the best idea I've ever heard of. So that was awesome. I, I, shame we didn't get to do that, isn't it? <laughs> I think I think if you're gonna do it, we need like a we need, we, four we need, or five hour we session. Need different, yes. we, need different, we need a different party like party component. That's what it boils down to. We need to not have the murder hobos take care of it because they'll well, find I it think you need to have the water elementals be immune because they're then you, would have, then you would have bitched at me that they that you weren't damaged. No, then we would have ran. <laughs> then I would have told Antonio to go fuck himself, and I would have ran. That would have used disengage at that point. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, the only reason, and I, would, reason I stayed with them because I didn't want them to die, and I thought that. So, hey, we have a so what you're saying is that Talia and I actually did the right thing by leaving. Correct. Yeah, yeah but the murder okay. hobo is to not do what the DM wants. Yes. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yes. You, you were, you, and, and, and having the two of you uh, separated enough gave us perfect time to do Brad and Janet. So that was wonderful, uh, wonderful timing on your part. But late. We're, we're going to go. Uh, there's like another half to this. Maybe I'll run it sometime. Probably not. Uh, follow us on social media. Yeah. yeah. Follow us on our social media account. Check out the. We have a Discord server. There's links somewhere. I don't fucking know. Check out the uh, have a good night. swag at tinyurl.com slash RPG swag. There you go. I'll see it on the thing. Yay. Bye-bye.